Hey everybody, so this is just going to be a quick video to show you how to get your images from your SD card in your camera into or onto Canvas. So the first thing you're going to do is open up your battery slot and then you're going to press down on the card and it should pop out a little bit and then just pull it out the rest of the way. So these SD cards are the exact same ones that you can get if you go to like Walmart or um, any you know electronics store so if you want your own SD card or you want a bigger one you can definitely get a bigger one we have the 16 gigabyte cards so my uh, Chromebook does not have a uh, port for my SD card so everybody's camera should have some type of SD card to USB uh, connector and so with this one you just put the SD card into the side like that and then I'm going to put this into my USB port on the side of my Chromebook. Uh, everybody else probably has a slightly different one where the SD card goes into the end but this was a, a replacement from a student who broke their version. Okay. So now I've got a couple of options. So I can uh, save my files from my SD card onto my Chromebook. I can save them onto Drive, which is what I recommend you guys do because it's generally got much bigger storage than your Chromebook. Or you can just upload for right now directly into Canvas. So to access these photos, I just click on the 100 Canon and I can see all the photos and movie files on my camera. If you are using this on a regular laptop, when you go to the USB drive, it's going to have a folder called DCIM and it's going to have some other folders. So you want to go into that DCIM folder and then into the 100 Canon folder. If you click into the wrong folder, you'll know because you'll just get like nothing or like some weird files. Uh, and so you can kind of back out until you find the right folder. But it's DCIM and Canon. So for these images, I could save this into my Google Drive. I could also save it into my files if I wanted to do that. So I recommend Google Drive just because it's got much bigger storage capacity. And now I can go into Canvas and I can upload those files the exact same way that I would with any other file, which you guys have already done in Canvas, so you guys should know how to do that. Uh, we're going to stop the video now because you guys don't need to see the copying items. It's probably going to take a while uh, because this Chromebook is a little bit slow. So we are going to uh, call it quits. And obviously, if this doesn't make sense or you're confused, email me um, in my work Gmail and I will answer your questions as soon as I can.